on the puzzle last night. Made some really good progress. And thought, great, I got some good stuff on the time-lapse footage. Nope. Super was not so super in pressing the time-lapse button, so it didn't record. Oh well, it's going to record now though. But uh, before I start, let me show you where we're at now. So, as you can see, we have made some significant progress, especially with the with the um, fishing poles on the shirt. Uh, really was putting that together pretty well. This was starting to come together too. The calendar, the picture, and the bait and tackle. And I'm starting to work a little bit on this. But not too much, but then the carpet's coming together and I got the cat. There's, where is he? I got the cat in here. There he is. Hi, kitty. That's where we're at. We're going to keep plugging away. So let's take a look at how we're doing so far in this Springbok 1000 piece, the bait shop puzzle. As you can see, we're making some very good progress. And uh, look at that, look at that flooring. It's almost all the way there. Uh, so we definitely made progress on the flooring. It's hooking up almost all, there's probably one piece right here for the broom, but hooking up all the way up there. Got most of the jacket and just starting to fill things in now. Uh, very enjoyable puzzle. I feel like it's just the right amount of challenge where it's challenging enough. Challenging enough, but it's not overwhelming. So uh, I think chances are pretty good. We're going to be finishing this puzzle in part two. Uh, so let's just keep cracking away. Alright, so in between watching the Super Bowl and doing our taxes and doing laundry and yada yada yada, I've been off and on on the puzzle all day today, on Sunday, and uh, got a lot done. So let me show show the uh, puzzle right now to all of you fine folk, the Springbok 1000 piece, uh, the, bait, the bait shop. Let me show it to you. As you can see, we've got a lot done, a lot done. Uh, I'd say probably what about almost 50% done or around 50% done Got all the flooring where it was working on this for a while all this is put together Is this of the quadrants a b c d? It's kind of like right here Is the big empty spot and most of that it just happens to be the bar, right? All that happens to be the bar that I haven't started working on yet. So that's going to be next, the bar, I guess. But I'm going to continue working on everything else as well, of course. And uh, it's coming together pretty nicely. It's definitely going to be done in part two. So that's the good news because then we could just move on to the uh, Clementoni 1000 piece puzzle, which was supposed to be puzzle number seven. 
but it's puzzle number eight. It actually came early. It, they said there was a two week delay and it came yesterday. So I do have that puzzle in the background, but I'm not gonna show it to you until this one is completed. So let's keep working on the good bait stole or the good bait shop, good bait shop. Well, I think we're in the final push of this 1,000 piece Springbok puzzle, the bait shop. Uh, we are nearing completion. Uh, still got a tough part of the puzzle to make, which is the bar section. Um, but let me just show you real quick what I'm You see in this about. puzzle, there's this big blue bar right there, right here. I haven't really begun work on that yet, as you can see in the puzzle. I've done almost everything else. Everything else is almost completed, actually. Look at that, I'd say we're about, what, 70%? 70% completed, but as you can see, that bar has not even been started yet. So, uh, like I said, we're in the final pushes of this puzzle. We're definitely gonna get this done soon. And uh, then we'll glue it, and we're gonna move on to, the... <laughs> look at me while I'm talking, but we're gonna glue it, and then we're gonna move on to the next puzzle, which is the one I was planning to do. The Clementoni puzzle, but let's finish this one first. I really like this puzzle. I'm really, I really enjoy it. Just the right amount of challenge. Um, but uh, you know these antique stores and bait shops and and good book stores. I, I kind of like it. It's got character. All right, so let's keep plugging away. Kind of in the final stage now actually we are in the final stage now of this puzzle that i've been putting together the springbok 1000 piece uh, bait shop puzzle uh basically what's left is to put this bar together that that blue bar right there in the middle uh put that together and this puzzle is pretty much complete let me give you a better look at uh where we're at right now with the puzzle so as you can see the puzzle is about what 80% complete 85% complete um, all that's needed now is to do that bar which is going to be located right here and that's pretty much going to do it and then we'll just fill in those extra pieces as we go but uh, this puzzle is 80 about 85% done I'm going to start working on that right now uh, we'll time lapse it and the next time I talk to you guys, this puzzle will be complete.
drum roll, please. Well, ladies and gentlemen, through sheer willpower and perseverance, we have conquered the Springbok 1000 piece, the bait shop puzzle. And let me show you in all its glory. Oh yeah, there it is. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. The Springbok 1000 piece bait shop puzzle. It is done. It is done and done with the dog and with the cat and all the goodies that are in this wonderful, wonderful looking bait shop. Great puzzle, just the right amount of challenge without it being too frustrating. Uh, how many hours? Probably maybe 10, 15 hours to do it. I would say probably about that. So, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, that concludes the Bait Shop Puzzle Springbook 1000. So that means we get to start on the next puzzle, which I will start shortly. And it's going to be a challenging one. It's going to be a difficult one. No bones about it. But it's very cool. And I, got, I like the art right away on it. It's not a Clementoni fine arts puzzle like I thought I was gonna do sort of uh, I did the Van Gogh Starry Night but this one is a ship it is a ship called what is a ship called the Amaroga Vespucci <laughs> the Amaro the Amaroga Vespucci am I saying that right Amar Amarigo Vespucci ship look at that isn't that beautiful huh isn't that something to behold right there look at that the ship sailing on the rocks the sail old style sailing ship with the wood i'll tell you one thing that sky and that water is going to be a beast no doubt about it but the ship has some nice detail so probably when i start sorting this one i'm going to sort uh the ship pieces and the um, and the flat pieces or the border pieces, and then uh, after that sorting, then I'll figure out the sky and the and the sea. So that's gonna be the next one. Hey, thank you for watching Super Dance Jigsaw Puzzles. I do appreciate it. If you haven't already subscribed, click the thumbs up, comment down below. Uh, I would appreciate it and. We're going to work on the next one very shortly. Cheers and uh, gone fishing. <laughs>